Welcome to this five minute overview of Jira Software Premium. In this video, we'll look at a few key aspects that are unique to Jira Software Premium related to the advanced roadmaps feature and how they'll benefit your entire organization. In addition to these several other benefits in Jira Software Premium, like 99.9% .9 financially backed uptime, 24 seven support, IP allow listing, and a host of others, Advanced Roadmaps adds many new features to your Jira experience that are designed for more broad company-wide planning to help your projects run efficiently, help your teams work better together across your entire organization, and align your work in helpful ways. We'll explore a few of these key features here and dive deeper in future videos if you'd like to learn more. The first feature we'll explore is plans, also known as advanced roadmaps. You're likely already familiar with the roadmap view in your individual projects, which displays your work items in a single project in a clear way that lets you plan and track work in that project. Plans are a specific roadmap view that brings multiple projects together so you can see a broader view of your projects all in one place. Here we can see a roadmap that you're likely already familiar with from a single project. We see some epics and some issues here to track the development of an iOS app. And here is that same project alongside a project for Android app development in an advanced roadmap. This lets you see multiple projects or work streams in tandem so you can better understand what's happening across all the work that you need to know about. You can create as many of these plans as you like, tailoring them to include exactly what you need to view or what you need to share with others without any superfluous data. You can create one for a department, for example, uh, another for your management team that only contains data relevant to their interests, and yet another that shows all the projects across the entire organization. You can configure these plans to include whatever project data you like. The sources for this data can be a Scrum or a Kanban board, a project itself, or an issue filter using Jira query language. Using a board is the most common issue source and is what we typically recommend, but you have the flexibility to use any of these sources to populate data in your plan. Next, let's take a look at using advanced roadmaps as a planning tool or a sandbox environment to fiddle with changes to your work streams before those changes impact any of the project data. Now that we have our plan set up with our mobile app projects, we can use this view to make plans and adjustments after seeing how everything is currently laid out. You may want your iOS and Android apps to launch simultaneously, for example, and you can reflect that by dragging this bar to align with the corresponding Android epic to publish the app. We'll want to push the marketing campaign out as well to match the new target date for when the app goes live. The plan operates as a sandbox environment where you can make changes to multiple projects from this view with the additional context of all your relevant projects right here in front of you. And when you make a change to a plan, this button up here will activate where you can review all the changes that you've made before any of these changes impact the projects themselves. You can collaborate with the project leads on these changes before pushing them live or uncover additional issues during your reprioritization that you can address before they impact anyone. Next, let's take a look at creating issue dependencies in advanced roadmaps. Just like you can link issues together in your individual projects, you can create dependencies across projects in your plans. We mentioned wanting to release iOS and Android apps together, so we can create a link between an issue in our iOS project and an issue in our Android project right here from our plan. That way, if work on one app completes before the other one, everyone will know to wait until work on both is completed before submitting them to Google Play and the App Store, respectively. After configuring your cross-project dependencies exactly how you like them, you can publish the changes just like we saw before, so they'll reflect in the project data for those teams. Now, beyond issue links, you can also drill down to your dependencies in this view. As your plan fills up with issues, having the ability to parse down to your dependencies gives you a much clearer view of what work relies on other work and which teams are waiting on others, helping you stay on top of cross-team outcomes. Now we'll take a closer look at this report and at dependency management overall in a later video in this series. The last feature in Jira Software Premium we're covering in this video is scenarios. As you configure your plan, there can be a number of assumptions at play and scenarios allow you to create alternate paths for your project delivery, letting you account for several different circumstances so you can compare them and determine the best way forward. Primarily a forecasting feature, scenarios allow you to build out several different possible paths to project completion. And with your epics, issues, and story points all spelled out, scenarios allow you to determine how project delivery might look with different resource allocations, for example, uh, or a difference in priorities of different projects. And we can see that we have some of these already built out here for us. 
You can plan for a best case where everything goes according to plan, a worst case where a few complications get tossed into your project, and anything in between. And as your project unfolds, you can continue to groom these scenarios in case you need to make adjustments midstream. That way, when your project is faced with a change of circumstances, either positive or negative, your team can have a way forward already planned out to embrace those new circumstances and move forward with confidence. This is just a reminder of the features that we went over today. Um, this really is just a sample of the ways in which Jira Software Premium can help you improve the planning and coordination within your organization. More videos are coming in this series where we will dive a little deeper into these features and discuss some of the additional features of Jira Software Premium in a little more detail. I hope you'll join us.